A new oh, deadly oh, pandemic is at our doorstep. Been following Get ready to be shocked. That prevention the new is the key to succeeding. It's not about reacting, it's about being proactive. So let's dive into these tips. Now, wouldn't it make sense to strengthen the things that protects you from the virus as opposed to reacting to when the virus gets inside of a weakened vessel, right? And that's basically how this stuff works. Regardless if they say you're more susceptible or you're more X, Y, and Z, you also are more susceptible to being able to rebuild yourself, to strengthen your lymphatic system, to strengthen your immune system, to strengthen every piece within your fiber of your being to where you can get better and nine times out of 10, not contract this thing. So method number one, if you haven't before, you need to learn how to detox. And look, I'm not saying go on this big extravagant long fast X, Y, and Z. I'm talking about the basics. So here's what you do. Get as much garlic as you want and get some ginger. Not too much. About a quarter teaspoon of ginger. I want you to chop the garlic really finely. I'm talking about super fine. And then whenever you get your ginger, start to grate it. Grate that finely as well. Next, you get you some eucalyptus oil or tea tree oil if you don't have eucalyptus. You need one drop and also get you some cayenne pepper. Now, cayenne pepper, I'm not saying go overboard with it, but you can be very liberal with how much you use. Next, you're going to need the juice of a lemon and some honey, preferably some local honey. And now you're adding a half a cup of water to that concoction, correct? Now, take that three times a day and watch how your system changes on top of eating a very balanced and nutritious diet. It's that simple. We don't have to be scared. We don't have to be panicking. We don't have to stop using our critical thinking skills. Everything on this earth has been blessed and placed for us to use for our consumption and our health and survival. Prime example, let's go to uh, Genesis 1 and verse 29. Then God said, I'll give you every seed bearing plant on the face of the whole earth and every tree that has fruit with seed in it. They will be yours for food. And what is everything I just said that we talked about? These things are, that you can grow. These are things that other people have grown and harvested and produced for us. So guess what? We need to use it. Now, if you want further handbooks and tips and tricks and references and stuff like that, click the link in my bio. I have holistic protocols, ebooks, all that type of stuff. Go have fun with that. But even with the one little tidbit of information that I've given you guys in this video is more than enough. Whenever you couple it with a balanced diet, it's more than enough to keep you safe, keep you healthy and keep your lymphatic system rolling. I hope this helped you out, friend. God bless.